Hi everybody, this is Nicole from 20 Something Planner. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a plan with me spread for the week of July 6th and I'm using this kit from Crafts by Towie. I went to go look up the name of it, but unfortunately it's no longer available in her shop, um, but it is a very homey uh, style kit. Even though a lot of restrictions in my area have been lifted, I do find myself home quite a bit still, which is totally okay with me. I am uh, definitely a homebody at heart. Um, this spread was a little challenging for me only because of the color scheme of the kit. Don't get me wrong, the colors are absolutely stunning like that. I don't even know how to describe that color, but um, the neutrals, ugh. They are so, so gorgeous. I actually wish I had stickers with that neutral background. Um, every time I went to go pull out an icon or something like that on a pink background, I couldn't really put it down because there wasn't a ton of pink in the kit, which is totally fine. Um, I just wish I had more icons that had white backgrounds. I have a ton of Crafts by Towie $2 Tuesdays, but I do like to mix up the icons that I pull into the spread. I, I always use a ton of Crafts by Towie icons in my spreads, but sometimes I do like to incorporate other shops uh, as well. So I definitely need to pick up more icons with white backgrounds just so in instances like this, I don't struggle to put down stickers. Uh, the sidebar was very monochromatic, but I actually, I thought I was going to dislike how it came out, but I actually think it turned out pretty. Um, that checklist at the bottom is from Paper Blush Bar, and then the script stickers, uh, the This Week and the Happy Mail, those are from Sweet Bella XOXO. Uh, I just got another order in from her shop, and it's becoming one of my favorites, uh, so I'm really enjoying her stickers. The date dots that I put up at the top, those are from Sticky Sloth Designs, and to me the numbers look holographic. I double checked my order, and I definitely ordered silver. I just don't know if her silver is a little bit on the hollow side or what, but I definitely see some like flickers of blue and pink um, when the light catches the sticker. So I don't know. Regardless, they still look pretty. I do really enjoy her date dots. They are a really good size and the font's pretty as well. Okay. So the first thing that I am marking on Monday was not really a new morning routine, but, uh, I did start my new job this week. So, uh, my start time is 8am and I haven't had a job where my start time was later than 730. So my morning routine has changed a little bit. I still wake up between 530 and six, but that's because I like to take my time in the morning and like enjoy a cup of coffee on my couch while I surf Instagram or something like that. I also have plenty of time now to prepare my lunches beforehand, which has been so helpful because it has really decreased the amount of uh, days that I order out for lunch. But to mark my new start, I uh, put down a flag from the kit and the coffee cup is a $2 Tuesday icon from Crafts by Towie. And then I used a Panda Bird Design scallop sticker to mark that uh, my fiance and I actually had solar panels installed uh, this morning. Our neighbors behind us just had them installed recently and my fiance reached out to the company and decided um, it was a good decision for us to have installed as well. So they came on Monday morning and got everything done. Um, and then I used a half box from the kit and a script work sticker to mark my actual first day at my new job. Um, the headers that I pulled in for this spread are from Harriet Wright Designs, and I do have a coupon code for her shop. At the time I'm doing this voicemail, voicemail, <laughs> this voiceover, uh, her shop is still closed, but as soon as she is open, I will announce it on my Instagram stories, but I'll post her, um, uh, or my code to her shop uh, in the description bar below. Uh, on Monday evening, I did some meal prepping. So I used a quarter box from the kit and a uh, mixer from Weight Deer Stationery. And then that bow layover is from Harriet Wright Designs as well. And then I had a call this evening and I marked that with a circular sticker from Simply Watercolor Co. And that cell phone icon is from Planning Like a Pro. 
On Tuesday, I started off with an apron sticker from Paper Blush Bar. I used that to mark that I had to skip the following week for my HelloFresh meals. I've been getting HelloFresh for over a year now. It's actually probably close to two years, um, but I wanted to skip the following week and my deadlines for like meal choices are uh, Tuesday evenings. So I just wanted to remind myself of that. Uh, and then don't ask me how an adult woman loses her driver's license, but I, I lost my driver's license. Um, and at this point, actually, I think this is the first day that the DMV was open and I was not going to the DMV <laughs> the first day, uh, upon its opening. So I actually filled out the form online to get a replacement license. So I used a reminder sticker from Crafts by Towie and the laptop sticker is from the kit. It was actually a very easy process and I already got my license in the mail. Um, but anyway, underneath that, I used a half box from the kit and a pair of sandals from a like a summer sampler sheet from Paper Blush Bar. Uh, I live right by a waterfront. It's like within walking distance of my house. And every Tuesday they've been putting on concerts. So my fiance and I took a trip down and uh, just listened to the band that was playing. It was a cover band of some sort. I can't remember for which band though. Uh, and then underneath that, I put a bow sticker down from the kit and uh, used that to mark a couple of things from Amazon that I wanted to place an order for. On Wednesday, I started off with a scalloped half box from Harriet Wright Designs and a money symbol from Simply Watercolor Co. I had some training on invoicing this day, so I used that combination of stickers to mark that. And then I marked that I had to schedule an oil change for my car. Uh, so I pulled in a calendar sticker from Harriet Wright Designs and a flag from the kit. Uh, then I put down a scallop sticker from Panda Bird Designs as well as a laptop girl from Panda Bird Designs and used that to mark a project that I was completing for work. And then, I'm sorry, but my camera died. Um, and I missed out on putting down a Happy Mail sticker from the kit. And then I just marked a workout with a quarter box from the kit and an exercise sticker from Paper Blush Bar, um, one of those really pretty paint stroke script stickers. I received an Old Navy package on Thursday and I did like a try on just to make sure everything fit, but how cute is that clothes rack sticker? That is one of Planning World's $2 Tuesdays. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I had to show you a close up. Uh, but I also have a code for her shop that I'll link down below for you. Uh, I used a sneaker sticker from my newest addiction to mark that I had to buy a new pair of gym sneakers. Mine were getting kind of old and worn out. Um, and then I used a strip of washi from the kit and a bundle of pens from Crafts by Towie to mark that I had to complete some new hire paperwork. At the end of the day, I marked meal planning with a quarter box and a menu sticker from Magic Prince Co. Sometimes I like to get meal planning out of the way like before the week even ends so I don't have to think about it over the weekend. I just have to go grocery shopping at that point. Uh, and then I stole that idea from Lauren of Plan Mosh Plan. I put down a strip of washi from the kit and a space divider from, I think that one's from Simply Watercolor Co. Um, but I just put that down to take up some space at the bottom. Uh, and then on Friday, I am marking a coffee run with my fiance with a circular sticker from Simply Watercolor Co. And I love that coffee cup so much. That's from the kit. Um, but he had to take me to drop my car off for my oil change. So we just grabbed a coffee beforehand. And then um, that car icon is from Simply Watercolor Co. as well. And then I am marking new releases here. Uh, I think this was the first time I placed a cloth and paper order. Um, that was the main reason why I was marking new releases. I layered a um, flag from the kit with a, a little arrow sticker from Sweet Bella XOXO, but I can already tell the cloth and paper it's just going to be an issue. I think I've already placed three orders with the shop. I just got an A5. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> the obsession is just becoming too real. Um, but next I am marking dinner with a friend with a GP sticker studio, a little place setting, and then I layered a uh, bow over top of the utensils. And then after that I marked, we went for like an early dinner 
Um, and then afterwards it was kind of just like a lazy night. So I used a half box from the kit to mark that. And then the sleepy mask icon is from planning world. Uh Oh, uh, I just got a notification that my, my storage is almost full on my laptop. I hope I have enough to just export this video, <laughs> please. Uh, okay. Um, on Saturday, the first thing that I'm marking is, uh, editing a video. I can't tell if I like or hate the way I <laughs> marked this, but I used another one of those small arrow icons or stickers from Sweet Bella XOXO. I layered an edit sticker over top of that from Rose Color Days, and then that pen, which I love so much, that is from a Hello Petite paper sticker sheet. Um, I think I like it. I think it came out cute. <laughs> um, but after I edited my video, I just cleaned up around the house a little bit. Um, so I used a full or no, a half box from the kit and that cleaning icon is from Crafts by Towie. The rest of, the rest of my day was super chill. Uh, I watched Clueless on Netflix, which was so amazing. I love that movie so much. <sighs> It was great. I think I had the house to myself. I just posted up on my couch and watched Clueless. Such a good movie. Um, I am marking, I don't know why I put two little check marks down originally, but I marked that I had to repot one of my plants with a check mark sticker from CD Stickers. Um, I am so plant obsessed right now. It's not even funny. And I just learned that you can buy plants off Etsy and they are beautiful plants. So unique, so gorgeous. I have like 10 in my cart. I need to slow my roll. Um, but uh, I also marked a YouTube binge with a couple of uh, flag stickers from the kit. And that YouTube binge sticker is from Lilac Luna Plans. Uh, on Sunday, I uploaded my video. So I pulled in the planner sticker that came with the kit. And then I had to get on the phone with the person who was covering me from my previous job. I had left her like a list of things and she just had a, some questions for me. Um, so I spoke with her for a little bit. And then uh, I had to go over to my friend's house to help her cut down a tree. We had some really bad rainstorms uh, the night before and like half of her tree fell down. So my fiance went over with a... Um, a chainsaw and helped her get rid of it but her mom used to own an italian restaurant and she made us lunch oh my gosh it's so good i could eat her cooking every single day um, but to mark that we had lunch at her house i just used a bag of flour from the kit and a bow overlay and then to mark that we actually like chopped down and removed the tree i put down a half box from the kit and another um paint stroke script sticker from paper blush barge just said to complete i didn't really have any um yard work stickers to use to mark that um but i just i love those stickers so i thought that looked pretty and then um i just ended up painting my nails this day so i used a nail polish bottle from the kit to mark that uh, and then this is everything all completed and filled out so so stunning i love this kit the colors are so beautiful but um i hope you enjoyed this video and i will chat with you all in my next one bye everybody